Okay, joined by Dublin Hurler, Chris Crummy, uh, here at the launch of Dublin GAA's partnership with Mitsubishi Motors. And Chris, I guess it's the midway point of the league campaign so far. It's uh, two games down, three games to go in the group stage. Uh, what's your assessment of the campaign so far? Uh, yeah, a bit of a mixed bag so far. Um, obviously, we're very disappointed with our performance against Kilkenny. Um, but we had a good meeting after and we were looking for a, a massive a massive improvement and I feel we got that against Leash. Uh, our performance improved immensely and so that's what we're just going to try, try to do for the remainder of the league and build on that performance and going into Carlo this Saturday night. Yeah, you mentioned the game against Kilkenny. How eager were you to get back onto the pitch against Leash after the disappointment against Kilkenny? Yeah, the, you, literally the only thing to to write that, that game is to get back training and get back onto the pitch. Um, and we were just wet. it was great that there was only a short turnaround uh, against Leash. Um, and uh, thankfully we put in a very, very good performance against Leeds, which is what we were looking for. Um, and hopefully we can, we can build on that now going into the next few games. You mentioned there it's Carlo this weekend. Uh, obviously uh, you played Carlo in the Walsh Cup there a few weeks back. Uh, what can you expect from, uh, from Carlo this weekend? Uh, we're very familiar with Carlo. We played them um, in the league and championship last year and we had a, a very tough game, particularly in the league here uh, in Parnell Park. So we know uh, the high quality of players that, that, are, that are in their, their set up and we, we know we're going to need to be at our best. Um, that's, a, that's a great challenge going, going into Saturday. Dr. Cullen Park's a tough place to go and uh, we, we're going to need to be at our best uh, come, come Saturday evening. And uh, Maddie has mentioned as well there after the Leash game, he mentioned some of the more experienced players going back, the likes of Paul Ryan and Shane Barrett. How big a boost is that to have them coming back in over the next few weeks ahead of a busy period in the league? And also, how big a boost has it been to see some of the younger players come through? The likes of uh, Davy Kyo, for example, has come through over the last few weeks and broken into the panel. How big a boost is that to see as well? Yeah, absolutely. It's great to have um, those lads that you mentioned, like Liam Rush and Shane Barr, come back from long-term injuries um, that they, they got sorted out at the end of last year. So it's great to have them come back to, bo to boost the team. And then also the, the younger lads that have, that have come in, the likes of Davy Kyo, Alex O'Neill, and then other lads who have pushed on from last year. So it's great to see, great to see, and so uh, every uh, team needs that that high level of competition, and and I think we really have that this year. And there's a great buzz within the camp at the moment, and and we're, we're just looking forward to the, to the season ahead and the game on Saturday.